Number four in our series on no knife pickles, here's a great recipe you can make using broccoli slaw. All you need to do is purchase a bag from your local grocery store, plop it in a bowl. We're going to add a little bit of some chopped onions that you can also get pre-cut if you would like from your produce section of the grocery store. We don't need all of them, we can save the rest for another meal. We're going to add some Italian seasonings. This is a blend without salt. And we're going to add some crushed red pepper. A little bit of crushed garlic. And this I am going to crush myself. I'm just going to smash it just a little bit. Doesn't need to be much. You could mince it if you would like. And then one last ingredient that's going to give some really nice flavor is some fresh Kalamata olives from the olive bar. And then we're also going to add about a tablespoon of liquid. Looks like about what I've got from the brine itself. It's going to be really yummy. We're going to mix that all together. And all we have left to do is pack it in our probiotic vegetable fermenting kit. So real soon, in just four days, this broccoli slaw is going to be rich in probiotics to feed your family. All we have to do is pack it in here. I'm going to actually use my hands, a little easier to accomplish it. Every so often I can stop and just kind of push it down, make sure we'll get it all into the jar. This recipe tastes so, so good on its own. When it's finished, you can just drizzle a little olive oil over it and you have almost a dish that stands on its own, more so than a condiment. It's very delicious. Can we do it? Let's see if we can do it. I'm going to try. We just need enough space for our floating brine cup to sit and float, and I think we're going to be able to do it. So let's go ahead and mix up our brine. That is easily done by just taking the salt, putting it into the water, and giving it a shake. push down on your brine overflow cup, you want to be right up to the top of the jar. We're pretty close. I'm going to call that good. All right, next we are going to take our custom rubber grade, <laughs> food grade rubber gasket. We're going to thread it onto our jar and we're going to take our airlock and we're going to put water in up to the max line. Got a little bit, I can just pour it back. There we go. Twist that in place, and there it is, just sits on the counter at room temperature in four days, this will be done and we'll have a beautiful side dish of probiotic rich fermented broccoli slaw. For more interesting tips and recipes, join our blog or follow us on Facebook and Pinterest. To order your perfect pickler supplies and accessories, please visit our website.